Jada Pinkett Smith brought Will Smith onto her Red Table Radio and admitted to her having an entanglement with August Alsina. The floor is yours, man. <laughs> First of all, entanglement. That's some bullshit right there, okay? How do you get in the tank? But you had an affair. You slept with the boy. Um, you gave. You gave. You, you let. You, he, you broke him off, and he broke you off. Okay. Entanglement is a nice word that they've, they've taken. I saw how they've taken this word and made means out of entanglement. How they can just play with it and make it seem a lot, a lot softer than what it is. No, you screwed him. Okay. You slept with him. I'm trying to be nice for YouTube here. But you did, y'all did the nasty. Y'all did the, the y'all did the wild thing, okay? And I don't care how much wild thing a man does. When this woman does the wild thing with somebody else, Ooh. that shit hurt. Oh, we could cheat on them a hundred times, but they that do it once. Hurt. Like, whoop. That oh, shit dude. hurt. Cause you know he had to penetrate not only her 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 her, her vaginal area, he had to penetrate her mind. Uh, okay. Yes. yes. Okay, he didn't just, you know, unless you just straight up, you know, uh, unless you ride the whole train. But for the most part, the average woman that give it up to another man, he has penetrated her heart and her mind. Mentally. Okay, and that means you ain't there no more. Mm. Mm. He's there, oh. you ain't there no more. Damn. He, couldn't, he couldn't get there if you was there. Ain't no room in there for both of y'all. Ain't no room in there for both of y'all. Damn. And that's why we know it, when, when a woman decides, okay, I like him. He cute. Let me give him some. Uh, bro, you pretty much on your way out. Damn, man. That's facts, man. Because us as men, you know, uh, we could just stick our penis into something and move on and don't even give it a second thought. But, yeah, when a woman actually lays down, spreads her legs open, I mean, that's months, years of just everything building up. And it's a mental thing, man. Yeah, like you just said. Yeah. yeah. It, 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 you know, we – for, for men, and this is, I'm going to do a, a game episode on this right here. Men, we have sex. It's, it's a physical uh, need. It's not necessarily, it had nothing to do with, it had nothing to do with. It's like urination. Ejaculation is just like urination. I'm it's, it's the same thing for us, okay? We have to do it just uh, for maintenance, okay? <laughs> it's basic man maintenance, okay? It had nothing to do with love, okay? And that's the part that the courts, that women and nobody else ever teaches teaches that part about it. It had nothing. To, the, the, us had sleep with somebody had nothing to do with love. Okay, nothing. We it's, it's a body fun, it's a bodily function. Mm -hmm. Just like going, you know, just like going to the restroom, whether it's number one or number two, it's a bodily mm -hmm. function. And I've always felt here goes some crazy shit right here. I've always felt that to put a, a man in jail without giving him a release a way of release um, <laughs> is like putting a man in jail without giving him a toilet. Damn, that makes now, a lot of sense. look at it the same way, huh? Yeah. I didn't even think of that. That makes a lot of sense. You put, you put, you put young guys, so you almost force guys into homosexual situations. That's right. You know what I'm saying? I mean, especially when it's so condoned on the streets. Mm. Think about that for a minute, man. You know, brothers, you know, it's, it's, it's almost acceptable. It's well, I'm almost my ass. It's acceptable for two brothers to be, you know, to hang out and do what they do. Okay. So if you're in jail and you already debatable or thinking about it, now you don't have no other option. You almost forced into a situation that you wouldn't, you, you may not be and as apt to do on the streets. But because your options are limited, in fact, your options are none, you mm -hmm. may just be tripped, you know, forcing that situation. I always thought it was, it should be a uh, cruel, unusual punishment to put a man in a situation where he cannot ejaculate on a regular basis. Mm -hmm. Just like he, sh he should be able to uh, use the restroom on a regular basis. You always, this is why I enjoy doing this show with you, because you always look at things in a whole different perspective. And, and I've been on this earth 42 years. I've never thought of it that way. That's ex You're exactly right. Yeah, it's, I mean it's it's cruel, dude. I mean you you tell somebody in their prime at, at 18, 19 years old, 21 years old, homeboy, get up before you do. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do today? Oh, we gonna do nothing. Okay, they wake up before you do. They call them morning wood. 
Okay? So if he doesn't know what you do, and sometimes you can take a leak and it go away, and sometimes it get worse. And ladies love Mr. Morning Johnson. <laughs> Mr. Johnson in the morning. Let's change oh. something before I get thrown up on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> Looking like a fist in the air, boy. <laughs> but did you uh did you see that video? Which one? The, the actual video of Jada Pinkin and him and him talking. When, when he was talking to him, his eyes got red and started like he was crying. Yeah. Do me a favor when you get a chance, watch like it's like a six minute video on YouTube. You gotta watch it, Alonzo. It's so cringy, man. It's like it's really cringy. Wow, I'll do that. I'll definitely do that. Yeah, it's just the way they were acting toward each other, and you could just tell it was so fake. And then Will, he did look like a lost puppy, man. He just looked like and 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 they ended it with um something along the lines, I'm paraphrasing, of course, but um uh, he said something like, I'll get you back. And she said, you got me back plenty of times already. He said, ha you're right. So basically, Will was probably out there for, having sex with other women. Well, ru rumor has had it for years. They had an open relationship. Oh, okay. Ru rumor, 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 rumor had it for years. They had an open relationship. And um, they, they did what they wanted to do, who they wanted to do it with. Okay? I think this may be the first time it went public. And that, that might be the issue. Home, somebody actually told, and that's what happens when you mess with somebody younger than you. They don't like to keep their damn mouth shut, okay? <laughs> Nowadays, too. When I was young, if I ever got something from my teacher, man, I'm keeping my mouth shut. I'm not but telling man, anybody. But see, you got social media nowadays. You know how many points you can get for knocking off a teacher, a teacher in social media these days? Yeah. And the teacher ain't got a shot. Yeah. You know, I, I mean, they busted Barry Luterno. Uh, with her, and when those, when those social media back then, mm -hmm. she just was, she couldn't stay away from the kid. But you know, yeah. she just died too. Yeah. yeah. You know, the fact that you, you just kind of brought something that just sparked something in my head. And I'm curious if this has happened to you or if you know that this happens a lot, but I had sex with an older woman when I was underage. I was 16 ish, 17. She was like 24 or something like that. Um, I feel a lot of that happens with dudes but if it happens with a girl it's a whole different story you know if a guy's 23 and he's having sex with a 16 year old that's that's a little weird but i think i feel like it gets a little pass or i mean basically i'm saying i was i was raped that was that's i mean it, by lack of better words i was raped right right <laughs> you smiling about it you ain't called nobody you ain't call uh, olivia you ain't call a special <laughs> unit svu you ain't call nobody you called your homies Guess what I did? <laughs> I didn't start telling people till about two years ago. <laughs> okay. I had, I, I, I had a friend of mine, same thing happened to him, man. He was messing with a girl. He was 17. She was 40. Oh, wow. He, and he thought he was doing something. I said, man, you know, you was being molested. Mm -hmm. You're right, man. I was. Mm -hmm. I thought you were being molested. Technically, she, you 17, she 40. Okay. You thought you were doing, you thought you was killing Big Six. But that's the difference in the attitudes, okay? We're always victors. Women, in some cases, are victims. Mm -hmm. Same thing happened, same exact numbers, reverse the, reverse the sexes. One's a victor, one's a victim. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Damn, I, I, I was proud of that. So I, I'm going give to her, give her a shout out. She's probably up in heaven right now as we speak, but thank you very much for your time. Was it a teacher or something? Or was it just a, just no, no. Uh, it was a, I was delivering pizzas and she, she was just like, knock it down, down. Yeah, and she was ugly, a little fat, you know what I'm saying? Like, so I'm going to keep it real. She was not a perk, but at, you know, 16 and a half, she was cracking. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, but I mean, obviously that's, that's horrible, and you know what I'm saying. Like it's a, it's, it's kind of horrible if you think about it. Like you said, if it was reversed, it'd be a whole different story. But you know, it, it, but it, again, it's real men talk, though, man. See, I think that's, that's one thing you don't see on television. You don't see men talking about men issues. Mm -hmm. That's something. I mean, you got women got the view, they got the real, they got all that right there. But when we talk, all we talk about is sports. Mm -hmm. Okay, all we talk about. You see four men at the table. You're talking about somebody with a ball in their hand. Men have issues too. Men have situations. Men have feelings. They don't think we have feelings, man. They think we're just a bunch of um, troglodytes looking to fuck, looking to have sex with something. Mm -hmm. 